I'm doing the same thing I've been doing for over 35 years. I'm really doing one-of-a-kind jewelry, and the majority of the time, the mine finds that you see on the show, it's the first time they've ever been shown. I think what really our edge is, I know exactly the story. That's what people love. They love the uniqueness of the materials that we find, but they love knowing that they're gonna have a piece of jewelry that they're not gonna see on everybody. We love our gem days, we love our big gem events, especially when Mr. J. King is in town. He is here, he's waiting in the wings, he's raring to go, he's got his coffee ready and by his side as well. Um, I wanna show you a couple things that Jay has because we have an action-packed hour. Big values, big opportunities. This bracelet needs no introduction. Multi-layer, multi-strand, that fullness on the wrist in either choice, either color, this is spectacular. Spectacular. I expect the lapis to be the most popular, to be quite honest with you. Uh, we know the story. We know how, how difficult it is in this day and age. We're at $109.98. There's a lot to see here, but I do want to show you real fast. Look at the clasp at the back. This is magnetized. No hassles, no issues, on or off. Easy and simple. Look at the fastening. Look at the design. Both color choices. Such a great buy. Less than $110 if you'd like to order it. Also, we have a gemstone in focus. We are going to spend about 20 minutes of this hour talking about a specific stone, and it's going to be this one. Take a look, first of all, at the color. You will see the undeniable, undeniable, beautiful, gorgeous purple kunzite. Yeah, purple kunzite. Take a look. I'll take it off its stand so you can see. This is, uh, there's a heavenly glow to this. It's out of this world. You look at it and you see a softness. Um, it's magical. I, I adore this. I know just before the show, the price was lowered to $179.99 because so much is sold out today. Uh, that has got to be one of the biggest buys of the day. Obviously, you're getting the necklace. You can wear the necklace by itself without the pendant or add in the pendant and you're going to be good to go. So with that being said, they're all on the way. We want to start the hour again with, as I always call a line lighter, a this day only, only while supplies last. Let's talk as your peaks, turquoise at $79.99. This is big, this is bold, it's beautiful, and that is not an error. It's not a mistake, it's less than $80 if you order it. Now, this is the lowest price we've ever seen on TV. Buy more and save on your jewelry. Five flexible payments. There's only one thing. There's only one thing that could get this absolutely off the charts, and that's hearing about it from the man himself in the studio, Mr. J. King. How you doing there, mate? Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> Jay! I know, you know, I'm gonna be in, uh, I'll be in England tomorrow night. The letting you in again? Yeah, you know, it's really amazing. It's just like, for people who don't know, okay, the British, just so you know, nothing personal. Go on, but Jack. In, 19, in 1776, you know, <laughs> certain people got ejected from this country, right? So, including my wife, they're slowly sneaking back into the country, right? So what I've done, because I'm a good American, I'm doing the, the reverse. <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking about going and, and, you know, taking over the islands, you know, bring the colonies back. You know? <laughs> He's staking a claim for a part of England. Oh, Jay, that's all. So you go tomorrow? Yeah, I go tomorrow. Yeah, wow. I, you know, uh, yeah, we live there, you know, in the yeah. summertime. So, yeah, I'm, I'm actually looking forward to it. It's going to be kind of fun. Well, listen, I'm happy to have you here tonight. You flew over, obviously. I flew over, and I got to fly back. I got to at 5 o'clock, guys, so I can fly back so I can put my plane away so I can get on the big bird. He has more energy than, <laughs> than anybody I know. It's unbelievable. Well, Jay, I know, obviously, they asked you to be here tonight. We wanted you here tonight because this is a massive day and a massive hour. Jay, does it get any bigger than this offer? <laughs> you, know, you know what's insane about this? Okay, um, well, what's really, really insane about this, guys, is, look, I just came last week. I was in Albuquerque, and I was invited to the International Turquoise Symposium. It's the first year that they had it. And they really, they had collectors, miners, um, they had um, 
uh, GIA was there, which mm -hmm. was really great, uh, you know, uh, to actually be able to uh, discuss things with them. We were at the Turquoise Museum, which oh, wow. if you ever go to Albuquerque, New Mexico, and it's well worth your time to go into the Turquoise uh, Museum and visit with Joe Dan and see what that, I mean, I, they, they had to literally drag me out of there and then they searched me when I left. <laughs> <laughs> They've heard about you, Jay, they know your reputation. <laughs> but God, but the thing that was really amazing is just like this. Do you know the whole theme um, was the rarity of, tur of turquoise and that um, I learned so things that I, you know, I've been in this industry forever, but you know, turquoise is actually uh, rarer than diamonds, which I knew it was rare. I did, you know, and I've always said that it's rare, but I, I really didn't realize it's even rarer than diamonds. Wow. I know it's rarer than, uh, than a lot of materials because you don't find turquoise, you don't even find turquoise on every continent. Right. This is a perfect example of really crazy stuff. Okay, and if you're a collector, this is Azure Peaks. Mm. Um, this is uh, mined in Mongolia. Mongolia? Yes. And this material that you're looking at here, this green material, yeah. was actually, this, this material could be up to, can, it's well over 10 years old because this was some of the very first rough material that we actually got from that deposit. It was green at first, yeah. and then as we started to go down and they were starting to mine lower and lower and lower, actually it's a, a, now it's an active open pit copper mine, wow. and as they're going lower and lower in the mine, it's getting more blue. So it's really this, but look at the size of this. But I just have to tell you, okay, this, to cut this necklace, to cut this necklace uh, took over four pounds of natural turquoise rough, mm. okay? And even the, even the brown here, that right there, that's all turquoise. Everything in that necklace, and when you test that, that is all natural turquoise. Look at how humongous that that necklace is. Think about the, that it took four pounds of that material. I, I have to tell you right now in yeah. today's market. Yeah. Now that you have to understand, I I was able to to get that 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 material is at least ten years old. Right. So a while ago. Right. Well, it, for me even it's. <laughs> <laughs> but at least it's at least ten years old. Just I'm just telling you because of the color of it. So that material right now, uh, we we are still getting material out of out of Azure Peaks uh, the deposit. But it's it, here again. The, it's changed. It's more of a bluer type material. So this is is really kind of some of the first material, some of the more rare material and the rare color. I'm not even going to talk about this price though. You couldn't even. You couldn't even come close to buying no. half no. half of the raw material. You couldn't buy half of the raw material and for what they're actually selling this for. It's really crazy. And turquoise is not going down. Right. Okay. It's <laughs> only going up right now. <laughs> and they're, they're, it's all based on supply and demand, yeah. you know? And when you have a huge demand for it and the supply, and that was one of the things at the symposium. Mm -hmm. Everybody was really, I was thinking, I, I did make two new connections, so I'm not going to go any further than that. But um, but I have to tell you, uh, uh, everybody more or less was got anything that you want to get rid of. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, listen, you're get, you're the one that's benefiting because of HSN the way they do the pricing. We talk about this all the time. HSN doesn't uh, differentiate between taking a, a pair of last season's jeans and discounting it or doing a special deal on the final quantities of a rare turquoise necklace. You truly are the beneficiary. You're the one that's getting it at that phenomenal price. As you would imagine, we've got hundreds of folks ordering. We're at $79 and change. It's as your peaks. It's that wonderful specialty, gorgeous deposit that absolutely gives you that source, the origin of this, something special. It's not the turquoise that you see other people wearing. It's gonna be distinctly yours. And when Jay talks about the colors, look at the character in here. There's so much to see this blend, this mix. This melange of colors that you've got is really attractive. And I think that's really the case in point. That's why it's so popular. Also, the size here, obviously graduating to the largest in the center, but there's a lot to see, a big size, small price. We have eight minutes left. Final eight minutes, flex pay is $16. Buy more and save with the shipping and handling as well is a big opportunity. Turquoise has always been, Jay, one of your signatures, right? In all of its beautiful forms. Well, you know, for me, um, 
You know, turquoise was the very first uh, raw material that I ever worked with. It's actually the first thing that I actually ever worked. Uh, first, first design I actually ever built or ever did was wow. in turquoise. Um, I grew up, I was fortunate to grow up in, uh, in the Southwest. But uh, when I really got introduced to it uh, was in high school in northern New Mexico. And all, a lot of my friends um, were uh, Native American. Also, a lot of them were... Um, were traders. I mean, they're they're, and when I say they're traders, their parents like own trading posts and okay. all kinds of stuff like that. So I got, you know, <laughs> I remember with turquoise. I mean, it's it's crazy the things that you that you remember. You know, recall, I actually had friends that had turquoise in their driveway lining. Now you have to say when I say driveway, you understand you got a, a dirt road. <laughs> You know, and maybe some alfalfa on both sides of the road, <laughs> and you would have pieces of turquoise down the road, kind of as a decoration, you know. And you know, it was really funny because then all of a sudden, you know, in uh, 1976, you know, turquoise was a bicentennial stone. But you know, I'm talking like uh, the late uh, late 60s, early 70s. All of a sudden, people start realizing turquoise and realize that all of a sudden there was <laughs> there was no no decoration no. anymore. Everybody, yeah, everybody figured it out. So. Um, I, I have to tell you that, um, you know, uh, I, I just have an affinity for turquoise. It's, it is by far my favorite uh, material. Uh, it's my favorite gem material. And I tell you, with, uh, with turquoise, um, it's extremely highly collectible, which was another thing at this turquoise symposium. It was three days. We had to go to this gala event one night. Um, you, I, I wore, I, you had to wear a tux. Oh, a tux? Okay, but I refused to wear that little bow tie thing. Do it. I do have a tux, my wife made me buy one a long time ago. <laughs> and so uh, I had that, I hadn't worn it in a while. It actually fit really uh, pretty good because I'd lost some weight, you know? And so I, um, I you know, we had to go do uh, this kind of like gala event and they were auctioning off and it's to support, it's to support this, um, you know, the, this uh, turquoise symposium. Uh, they, uh, so the Turquoise Museum had donated specimens, and, and then a lot of the miners had donated specimens, and there were other uh, uh, designers that d donated, and they had this auction. You wouldn't believe what some of the specimens sold for, and it was just crazy. I mean, and it really kind of dawned on me, oh my gosh, you know, I remember that material from the 70s, and I remember that material from the 80s, and now, um, there is none of it, and so it, they're highly, highly collectible. So you know, turquoise is—they're—they're they're not. I, I think it's just—it's just fun for me. I love collecting it. I love collecting yeah. specimens, and we go all over the world to acquire new material. And this one, we went to Mongolia. Yeah, this is actually comes out of Mongolia. It's one of two. Uh, we have Azure Peaks is a deposit we buy from. They're both copper mine related, and then the other one's Turquoise Hill. Well, we'd love to send it to you. There's the uh, world famous findings at the back, the uh, ingenious, easy to use clasp with the little heart. Um, Jay, we always love this because it allows us to change the length depending on what suits us best and what we're looking for. Well, you know, and this was actually, you know, our viewers are the ones that, you know, that we, we came up with that finding, I think, uh, 23 years ago, 24 years Gosh. ago. And it was our viewing audience that actually said, we used to use lobster claws sure. back in the day, right? And uh, people, they would say, you know, gosh, we l really love these big looks, these sure. big designs. Um, but that lobster claw, I'm getting a little bit older. It's, it, I fumble with it. It's, it's difficult to put on. Is there any way that you think you could come up with a, a, something that's a little bit more user friendly? And, um, you know, we did the hook and eye. And then, um, I forget, I think it maybe it was Brian that figured this out. He said, you know what? Why don't we do an extender chain too? Yeah. And then we'll, we'll, uh, we'll be able to actually, you can hook it into the extender chain. And so it gives you different links. So you've got two and three quarters of an inch there to play with. And it goes up in, in quarter inch increments. So you can adjust it. You can kind of fine tune it to how you want to wear it. Well, we are thrilled that you've loved this as much as we've loved talking about it. Stay right there for yours, 796504. Jay, have you heard of this new thing we're doing? It's called Steal the Deal. Have you heard of this? If I did, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> 
least you're honest. I know what steel is and I know deal. Okay, you but get no, the concept. I get the concept. There's something about theft going on. There, there is. <laughs> it feels like you're stealing it from us because the price is so low, the value is so great, and that's what we're going to do here. It's phosphiterite, it's turquoise, it's an earrings or pendant opportunity. We're down to $59 or $129 oh for the pendant. Take a look up close and you're going to see what is so, so spectacular. Jay, this is a big deal. Do you know what? Are you kidding me? You know what this is? This, oh my God, this is... <laughs> do, do you know, you know what the, this turquoise material is? Go on. Okay, this is royal blue turquoise. This is the, guys, this is the most expensive turquoise that I own. The, this, this rough material costs more than the My Sleeping Beauty, My Blue Basin. I don't have a single oh turquoise my in my inventory, in my inventory that cost as much as this rough material. We have an exclusive on this material. In fact, um, we should be getting uh, some more of it in. And I will tell you the price isn't going down. This is the finest of the finest. They, 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 nobody else really, um, we, look, we still have an exclusive on this. We're buying, we don't, we're not taking any of the lower grade roughs right now. They're happy with us just buying the high grade. Uh, we're generating enough. There is some lower grade material. All of this material is high grade material. But this is the most expensive turquoise that I have that I personally own. I, I, I've spent more money. I, this cost me more per gram than any turquoise that I have in our private collection. Well, you just sold it to me, Jay. I saw the look in his eye. It was- <laughs> Well, I didn't realize, you know, I was looking at the design and then I realized, holy cow, that's- <laughs> <laughs> you know that really that this is this is royal blue. We you can't even go buy this anywhere else. You can't get this material. Nobody has this material. If you want it, we're nearly sold out. You've got to run and order it. The phosphiterite and the turquoise. It's the royal blue. It's amazing. Just while we've got a moment, I also want to let you know that our gold color matrix turquoise collection is available. Ninety three dollars. It's a brand new, new lower price on the ring and the bracelet at two sixty two. I mean, the clues in the name, Jay, there's gold matrix running through it, right? You know, what makes this material, this is a Chilean material. Okay, but I want you to carefully look at this material. This is, um, do you know, like, when they, when they do something that's, uh, that's, that's faux, are we going <laughs> to... <laughs> I'm gonna make a B-roll. <laughs> okay, when, uh, you know when, when you uh, uh, when they you know when they uh, duplicate things or they you know they uh, imitate you know imitation. That was another thing that the symposium, symposium talked about: to Im imitation of turquoise imitation materials. One of the things when you imitate something, what do you do? You imitate something in nature, yeah. right? Yeah. That is considered the most valuable. Yes. Right? So when you imitate something, you don't, like, if you're gonna counterfeit something, you don't counterfeit a $1 bill. Yeah, right? you go for the 100. Yeah, you go for 150, 20, come on, man. You know, you don't, you're not gonna, you know, why waste your time counterfeiting a $1 bill, right? So, you know, uh, there's a lot of counterfeit materials and there's a lot of uh, materials out there in turquoise and that gold matrix is one of the things that they counterfeit and that's natural right Real. there. Real, the real deal. And it's one of the few turquoises that I've ever owned that actually has the natural gold matrix. If you want to see more on the gold matrix, certainly go online and uh, use keywords gold matrix and it will come up. Spectacular ring, gorgeous cuff. Um, we're moving along to this next sale price. This needs no introduction. The number of hosts that you see wearing this bracelet. I don't think a day goes by whether Suzanne's wearing it or Lynn's wearing it or Tamara's wearing it. Um, this is our seven strand layered bracelet, obviously in lapis or the red coral, both equally as significant, equally as important. We're at $109.98. Uh, the oval gemstone that you see in the center, this has been a massive, massive success for Mind Finds with J. King. And if you've not added this to your collection, stay with us for just a few minutes to understand what it is, how it's made, and how important this is to the line. Jay, you created a magnetic clasp. The layered look, it's all done for you, ready to go. Yeah, I mean, well, we do it for you. <laughs> 
<laughs> this isn't a kit. <laughs> you have to explain these things. I'm Adam. sorry, Chad. Okay, I'm just telling you. That's that why I'm next here. Do it that's yourself. What... <laughs> you could be on the video giving instructions. You know, this this could be. You know what? We might have we might have something going on here. We're onto it. Uh, so you know, the, the cool thing with this is this, and and this is kind of fun about what we do. And this, uh, we have the lapis and we have the coral yes. left. So. The, the thing with this is it has an a, a incredible magnetic closure, and the magnetic closure is actually something that we built. I'd show this. Yeah. Why don't you show it? Thank you, sir. You hold that one, I'll hold this. Well, <laughs> see, I like to be of help, you know. You do. I love that, that teamwork <laughs> again. That's the red coral. And there's the plasma in the back. <laughs> okay, but you see this? You see how this... Okay, now, I want you to think about this. And this is really kind of cool about what we do. Um, the, you can't buy that finding. No. The only way to get that finding is we manufactured it. We made it. In fact, we invented that. And um, that is that is uh, Brian Bruce. I mean, it, this guy is, you know, he's, um, him and Crystal are, are amazing, both of them. But Brian, he c comes up with this stuff. It, it, you know, it's really genius. You know, we could actually sell these findings. I bet you we could. have, a, you know, we have a lot of people that ask us if we will sell our findings, but you, you can't buy. You know, you, these are made. We manufacture these just for like this design. We made yeah. it for this design. Yeah. Uh, and what we want to do. So th that's kind of the cool thing about being a manufacturer, and also having a show is the fact that you could, you could go, wow, you know, this wouldn't this be cool to be able to make like a, a stranded uh, bangle bracelet, but actually be able to include a cabochon mm -hmm. in it also, mm -hmm. right? And that's where the idea started. Um, then what we, we were trying to figure out, well, how do you do that? And then the clasp, how do you clasp it? Do you know originally we tried to do this like an elastic, like a stretch? Okay. And we tried to do it that way, but here's the thing. With, when you have the cab on the top, it kept floating down to the bottom. Okay, makes sense. Right? Yeah. And so it wouldn't, it wouldn't hang right, it wouldn't wear right, and we were thinking, okay, what do you do? And so we thought, well, you know, you, know, you need a clasp for this, but they don't make a clasp for that. And so there again, uh, Brian, you know, uh, he sat there, played with it, and he actually built the prototype, and then uh, we actually built everything that we needed to actually manufacture that particular finding. So here again, you know, how custom is that, okay? I mean, even when you build your own findings, yeah. I think that's pretty What more do you want, Jay? Yeah, I, I mean, really, guys. Come on. What, yeah, what more can you ask? <laughs> so that, I, I just think it's a cool look. And you know, um, I've actually, this is one of those, those designs that I've, it's funny that you would say like you've seen hosts and everybody oh, wearing everybody. it. This is one of those designs that I've actually met people in my travels mm -hmm. and, and just out and they're wearing it. And, and I'll walk up and I'll say, that's really cool. God, I like that. And they'll start telling me about it and then they'll realize and they'll go, <laughs> you look familiar. <laughs> Or the, and it's, I've had that a, a few times where people actually have been wearing this, and, and I've just caught up and said, man, that is really cool. And they'll start telling me about it. And of, of course, you know, and then all of a sudden, they, then they, it dawns on them that, wait a minute, you know, you're, they don't recognize you, they recognize your voice. The, the, do they do you, that with you too? Well, yes, the English accent gives it away. It gives it away. Because people come up and they think, you know, I think that's who it is. Yeah. But then you talk, and then yeah. they go, yeah, that's him. Well, but, but you, Jay, you're very distinctive. I've been told that, but I always thought it was because of the way I look. <laughs> <laughs> you have a presence about you. You know what's really funny? Do you get this too? People will come up to me all the time and they go, you look really different on air. You know? <laughs> and I say, because, you know, because I say, well, yeah, you know, you got makeup. Yeah. So yeah. it helps. I normally don't get up and put on my makeup, guys. Okay? <laughs> Unless I'm camoed. Or it's a Saturday night. <laughs> <laughs> well, unless I'm camoed. Uh, Jay, I listen, you look amazing in real life. Obviously, I ca and that's something that people say. They always wonder, is what you're seeing on camera, uh, you know, the real deal? And Jay, you always say this about the jewelry. Yeah, you know, well, you know, the, the thing with the, you know, I've had, uh, I think one of the biggest, you know, it's really kind of cool to meet people, you know, and they're wearing your designs or thing. Because, do you, you know, um, Unfortunately, we, we, you know, like if I was selling this to you right now, I would get your immediate feedback, right? And then we'd have a relationship and, and I would get your immediate feedback. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of cool to actually meet people mm -hmm. and then really hear, or a lot of people now, a bit, we've become friends. Mm -hmm. And um, they'll, they'll, let you, they'll say, I bought this, you know, and I like this, I, I don't like that. And here again, it's quite okay. Uh, if there's something you don't like, 
um, then it actually helps us in a way because there, then we'll look at a way to maybe do that better yes. or maybe you know try to improve whatever that that issue is. Um, so you know, uh, good, bad, it's it's all good, you know. And one of the things that people tell me constantly yeah. is the first time I ever bought from you, and I saw what it was, and then I saw the price. I thought, yeah, right. When I get this home, That's what I I'm, gonna, I'm gonna open the box and this is gonna be like half the size. It's gonna be really dinky where they held it really close to the camera. Have you ever done that with fish and stuff? Like people with fish and stuff, you go, oh, look at the size. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's really, it's only like six inches, sure. but you're holding it like this far from the camera lens, it's right? Secret. So that's the, you know, the secret to size. But you know, and I think that that's one of the, the that I've been told that numerous times. And I think that that's really cool that they mm. actually get it and then they go, wow, Man, you know, it really is massive. And it's because we're a niche business, okay, for people who haven't shopped with us. We, I, I don't, I'm not aware of anybody really that does exactly what we do. I, 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 I don't no. know of anybody. No, no. But there, I'm not saying that there aren't people out there maybe that, uh, that uh, do have, but we, but we really, we go right to source on our materials wherever possible. Mm. We do all the laboratory work, we do all the silversmithing, we do all the designing, we do all the qual control, we do everything packaging, and then we bring it directly here to you. So there really are no middlemen in, in our process. Well, you can see the result of no middleman when you've got a price like $109.98. Okay, well, I didn't do that. <laughs> okay. This is the HSN craziness my, lane. Okay, my price was fair. Okay. <laughs> okay, my price was fair. And actually, the original price that we did this at was more than fair for what it is. I mean, in fact, that was a great, great, great value, great price. This is what they do when they're just down to the last. And just so everybody knows, they're down to the last few of these. The you've got price. these two materials, the last two choices. So... Well, I think it's very clear, Jay, that obviously today, when you were getting ready, you were looking at an image of this tonight mm. because you match perfectly. <laughs> <laughs> look, look at Jay, no, seriously, look. Do you know look, that, okay, I saved, I saved this, okay, but I saved, I saved this, I saved this jacket just for you because, you know, we're in a competition and he doesn't know it, right? <laughs> I knew when you no. walked in, you'd won tonight. No, I gotta tell you because you know, like um, you know, my wife and I, we, we always we always talk like Adam. Um, you know, I've got a lot of sports yes. jackets, right? But I gotta tell you, I would love to go see your collection. <laughs> you must you must have like probably the largest because I watch you all the time and you have a different jacket. It's every embarrassing, time. So, Jay. So I have to. I, I every now I'm, I always think, okay, I have to do something unique and special for Adam. Well, you look amazing. <laughs> I, I tell you, <laughs> jumping out of the screen, and we love that you're enjoying the show and watching. There's a lot going on. Um, we're going to take a few moments out. I do want to tell you, though, we have some amazing things online, amazing items you never even see on the air. That's right. You only ever find them at hsn.com. Top brands, exclusive names and bundles, plus thousands of products all the time. Discover our best steals and steals all in one place, including offers you do only see there. We make it smart and easy and fun. On the way next, we're going tropical. We're going to talk Larimar, the beauty of Larimar. Grab your pina colada and we'll see you after this. the best deals on the things you love with the HSN card. As an HSN card VIP, you'll get all kinds of perks like VIP financing on so many items, plus extra flex on every item under $399 all day, every day, and at least eight VIP savings events a year. Includes fraud protection and there's no annual fee. Apply now and instantly get $10 off when you're approved. Call 1-800-695-1418 or visit hsn.com slash HSN card. Worry about one less thing with our Protection Plus plans at HSN. Electronics, fitness equipment, even jewelry can be covered. Shop smarts and protect your purchase. It's easy to add when you're checking out. Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. Your favorite hosts are celebrating big anniversaries this August on HSN. Join the party as Michelle Yarn and Debbie Denman mark five years hosting. Looking good, Debbie. Of course I am, girl. Adam Freeman hits his 15th anniversary. Cheers. Plus, it's the big 3-0 for Lynn Murphy. Whoa! 
Oh. Hi. Tune in all month long for special programming. And don't miss a show celebrating Lynn Murphy tomorrow on HSN. The first piece of diamond jewelry that I received was a gift from my parents for my graduation. They were little eeny teeny weeny diamond studs. I had always wanted to own a pair of diamond studs. I still say today, they're like the lingerie of your jewelry collection. And Carol will be Skyping in live from New York City in just 30 minutes time to so stick around for our final hour of this big gem event. I promised you Larimar and Jay, well, Jay's gonna regale us with the story of Larimar and how this is not the easiest thing to bring to HSN. The one thing I know about Larimar is that whenever it's on screen, Everybody adores it. They fall head over heels in love with the color. It reminds them of maybe that tropical vacation they took. Jay, why is it so hard? Why do we see so little Laramar on HSN? Well, you're gonna see even less because uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> next year, literally, okay, I just want everybody to be aware of this. The Laramar you're seeing now, yes. these designs, yes. okay, were some of the last designs that we were able to make with the rough material we had. Oh. So there is no more material for us to work with you will see no new designs. I, I guarantee you this, there is no new Laramar designs coming from me whatsoever. We're already, we're already written a good portion of 2023. We have to work way out, guys. Here's the, I'm just gonna give you manufacturing 101, all right? Okay. No rough material, no design. No, okay. Let me get this right. No <laughs> rough material equals no design. Equals no design. Okay, and in this case, look, if you want Laramar, and, and here again, you could buy Laramar. And um, if you go to the Caribbean, go to the Bahamas, uh, go to Florida. I mean, go to, go to the Keys, go to um, uh, St. Augustine, places like that. Go to the jewelry shops and see what they get for Laramar in this quality. This is one of the few materials that have frustrated me um, in my career. I have been, okay, starting before this material really became famous, uh, I've been to the Dominican Republic and I've been to this mine four times. There's only one mine that this comes from. It comes from the Dominican Republic. Um, it's not a huge operation, but you know, they, they get material, they don't get material. They're, the pricing structure, it's the, it, it's the only mine that I have never been able to buy my rough from direct. The only mine you've never been able to buy from direct. I've never been able to create a deal with them. Now, why would, would they, okay, well, I don't, I'm not really sure. They don't, <laughs> you know, like, um, I have been four different times. Um, it always was, of course, it comes down, to, it, like any material that I do, guys, it comes down to quality of the material mm. and the price, mm. right? I have to have a certain, I have to have a certain quality, and of course, since I'm buying large volumes, then I need a really good price. That's how we're able to offer you the deals that we offer you. If I told you just what this cabochon normally would cost, and literally, I'm not gonna say it, but I gotta tell you, I think it'd probably blow your mind. Yeah. What you would normally have to pay for that, just the cabochon, not any of the silver work, not anything. This is a one source material. I was never able to go directly to the mine. I've, I've been, never been able to negotiate a deal. The, the, either the qual, the, they would give me the price that I wanted, but they wouldn't give me the quality that I needed. Right. Or they would give me the quality that I wanted and that I needed, but the price the would roof. have been to the point where really I couldn't offer you a deal. Right. I mean, I wouldn't be able to really design with it and really, um, you know, be able to to really feel good about what sure. I was doing for you. So. I have a connection that was in related to this group. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> and I was able to be able to get Laramar wink, right. Wink, yeah. No, well, I okay, I mean it's all legit and everything. Yeah, yeah, I use yeah. a broker for them, I assume. Um, and I was able to buy Laramar Rough in this quality, which is really a nice quality, guys, for Laramar and at a price. That, it wasn't cheap, but it was fair, right? It was what I needed, and I bought volume. I was able to do that a couple of times, and 
now they, they're, I just, you know, I just don't, he doesn't have any, I have no resource, I have no way of getting this. Um, he, the, like I said, even if I go to the mine, um, which, you know, I'm not saying that I might not try that, but I literally have no Laramar rough. So this is super high grade Laramar for the value that it is. And anybody, anybody who has ever been to the Caribbean, if you've been to the Bahamas, if you've yeah. been to Florida, if you have ever seen this for sale, number one, I doubt you've ever seen a necklace. You'll normally when you see this, you see cabochons, sure, right? Absolutely. You see a ring. All day long. Uh, sometimes you'll see a cuff. You see a lot of rings and a lot of earrings. Yeah. And um, or that's what I see. And you do see some pendants. I very seldom do they ever cut it into beads right. because of what I just told you. The, if you know, like a beaded necklace like this, yeah. Um, would be literally hundreds and hundreds of dollars, Big hundreds money. Money. of dollars uh, to be able to actually do this if, if I had to pay uh, the price that, that really is being asked for it. Well, they say it's who you know, not what you know, and you know Jay and Jay's able to bring you the best, as he always has done. We find a way, and that's what this is, that fine example, that premium example of Laramar. But this is the end of the road, certainly for now anyway. So if you're looking for a Laramar necklace and you love that beautiful heavenly blue color, yes, it's tropical, yes, it's uplifting, yes, it's full of soul, this is gonna be an amazing sale price of $146.99. Obviously, length is 18 inches, but you've got nearly a three-inch extender on the necklace, so you can really make this your own. The cuff will give you the details on as well, because the cuff is obviously in a league of its own. Look at the size there. Um, and look at the quality of the cap, guys. Yeah. I mean, that's, that's the key thing. If you'll see, you know, here again, go price what these cabochons cost. Well, the ring and earrings. Ring is 100, earrings are 130, uh, and then the, the, the cuff is 300. But again, the value that you're receiving here is just phenomenal. I mean, really spectacular. 099708 if you'd like to order. That's our Laramar collection. We don't have any more Laramar. Heaven knows I wish we did, because it's extremely popular as always. Coming up tonight, um, we're talking Corres. We are going to Greece, Jay. We're gonna go to Greece. Have you been to Greece? I have. Was it lovely? Uh, you've never been to Greece? I've never been to Greece. Oh my God, do the islands. The islands? Yeah, the islands is the thing to do. Yeah. Actually, uh, if you want to go with us next year, we're taking the Harleys. Oh my, can you imagine? <laughs> I'll ride on the back with you. No, 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 I don't like her. You have to learn to ride. Okay, but we're, we're gonna go, and then we're gonna go through Italy, take the ferry, and go to Greece that way because uh, we can't really go through the certain section there. And um, and then we're gonna take the ferries around the islands. That it's gonna be cool. Amazing. Yeah, it's gonna be a fun ride. Okay, well, that's it. We'll take you to Greece tonight. You don't need any motorbikes, <laughs> but we'll take you there tonight with Corres. That's the new today's special. We wanna go here. It's our gemstone in focus. Focus. Every time Jay's on, we try to spend at least a few moments of the show focusing in, honing in on a particular mine find, on a particular gemstone, to really give you that in-depth story. Tonight, we're going to talk about kunzite. In this case, purple kunzite, uh, brand new. We are sale price of $179.99. A lot of pre-sales already on this, Jay. There is a lot to talk about in terms of bracelets and earrings and rings that we'll get to. Let's start with the necklace. Purple kunzite, what is it and where does this come from? Okay, it comes in a purple and a pink. When you're saying purple, it's more of a violet. Sure. Okay, but you know, we're, we're saying purple here, but it really is not really a purple, it's more of a violet. It comes in violet and it comes in pink. Um, this material is unique in the fact that it comes from the Josh Plateau in uh, Nigeria. So um, that's, that's where it's being mined. Yeah. What's, um, okay, I also have, I have sources on this material, uh, kunzite, which is more of the pink material. Uh, I have a, a mining um, operation that, that uh, I have a relationship with in Brazil that I get the pink material. Okay. What, what I love about kunzite, and what, I mean, this is really a gem material that in the gem world is fairly young, fairly new. And and I, I know you're probably you're probably thinking oh like you know ten years no I was going to say it, recent it, discovery it, recent discovery 1902 oh okay. <laughs> so not so recent then but okay when I say that okay the reason I say that is this if you go if you well you're, we were talking about Europe if you go to Europe 
right? You're not gonna see kunzite in any of the royal gems. You're, you know, like any of the crowns or anything like that. Any, you know, they did a lot of, you know, gems they would decorate, uh, especially uh, weapons. In fact, you really don't even see diamonds till later on, mm -hmm. right? Uh, diamonds were not a big thing. Rubies, emeralds, sapphires, mm -hmm. that's what you see. Um, you wouldn't see like kunzite, even though it is a gem material, right? Um, it's actually uh, a gem form of spodamine is, is actually what this particular, is what kunzite is. Um, it was really came, um, the, uh, it's named after George Kunz, uh, who actually was a mineralogist for the Tiffany and Company. Okay. And people that, who don't know, you know, Tiffany and Company was at, um, everybody knows them as like high-end jewelry yeah, sure. and all that, right? Do you know at one time, the, uh, Tiffany, um, they owned uh, turquoise mines. They owned all kinds of different mining I operations. Didn't know they brought, Tiffany brought so many gem materials to the market. And um, their, their top mineralogist, uh, George Coons, is uh, who actually, when they first discovered this, um, he is the first one that really, or the one that really maybe identified it first as a form, a rare form of spodamine. And so um, when they named this, they named it after him. So they named it Kunzite. Then that's where the name came from. And this material, it's one of the very few. I, I get three different rough materials out of, uh, out of Nigeria. And this is one of the gem materials that I get out of there. That's the stretch bracelet. And we'll give you all the details in a few moments. But if you love the look, love the color, uh, but maybe the necklace and pendant isn't for you, I just want you to see that there is a stretch bracelet. There is a ring available. There's a spectacular, I mean, look at this cuff. Uh, look at the design that you've got with all that sterling silver. I mean, Jay, uh, chic, elevated, a luxury design. It really is, and this material here again, you know, to be able to get this quality, be able to, to be able to have this quality, and be able to put it in these designs, and, and be able to actually sell it at this price, at this value, yeah. um, is really, really amazing. And we, we're gonna show you, we have another necklace coming up too. This material though, the color of this material, um, and the grade of the material is really, really, um, fairly high grade mm. and uh, it is natural. So just so everybody knows, uh, we, haven't, we haven't treated this, we haven't colored enhanced this it's or important. anything. It's, but it, it, it's the, the kind of material, the grade of material that we got a really super nice grade of material and we could actually uh, cut big bold designs without them costing you thousands of dollars, right? Yeah. I mean, so we made it affordable for you in natural kunzite. Uh, there it is without the pendant. So you've got a necklace by itself if you so desire. So obviously we've got multiple looks here. $179.99, five flex pay of $36, one of our most popular pieces of the entire show, as we thought it would be. It's nice to discover new things. And Jay, I mean, we're going on, what, 27 years? 27 years, yeah. That's how it began, right? It was the idea that you would tell stories about mine finds, new stories, things that we didn't know. You know, it's really, um, it's really strange, actually, <laughs> how I got on here. Um, but, um, yeah, you know, um, I've been doing this for, um, I started my business on 20. I'm going to be 66 in September in case you want to get me something. Uh, thank you for reminding me. Favorite colors, Ferrari red. Oh, Ferrari um, red. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> so, um, but I've been doing this, so basically 46 years professionally. And when I say I was doing it a long time before that, but professionally when I started actually doing this business, paying taxes and all that good yep. stuff, right? Um, so uh, in that time, so we've had the show for 27 years. How we got started, though, is I was uh, designing, making, manufacturing, and we were selling one-of-a-kind designs. I mean, mainly to galleries. Uh, we did a lot of trade shows where we sold to high-end fashion boutiques. I sold to Bridge, uh, Bridge Jewelry Store. I sh sold all over the world. And in those travels going all over the world, I started making all these contacts yeah. with different miners and finding different materials. And then I would bring those back, those rough materials, and put in my designs. And that's how kind of mine finds came. We were actually manufacturing and selling jewelry because we're... We're manufacturers, okay, that's what we do. We're designers and manufacturers. Yeah. We, uh, that is, that is, uh, that is our, uh, that is what we do. Yeah. I mean, that, that is, 
um, how we operate. And through me selling um, to HSN, they said, this is really great, and we want you to come on and tell that <laughs> a story. And to tell you the truth, I'm not a camera guy. I really, uh, I'm just going to be honest with everybody here. I really didn't fought it. I didn't want to come on. You, you, ba you battled it. You didn't want to do it. I, I battled it. I really did. It turned out to be something really special and really great, but I really didn't want to come on. I'm, I'm being honest with you. I, you know, I, um, I'm not... Uh, yeah, I mean, for me. So, uh, would you would you describe yourself as more of a shy person in these kind of scenario settings, or it just wasn't your thing? I'm not going to say I was ever shy. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say nobody's ever accused me of being a wallflower. It's just I, yeah, I just, I just know, you know, the camera and stuff like that. It was that all just different. Was, yeah, 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 yeah. It's not, not my really. Well, thank goodness you did, James. <laughs> <laughs> Took a leap but of it faith. Was, it was actually um, Sue Barker, the, the buyer, that more or less um, said, no, you will do this. And so, you know, but it's turned out wonderful, and I'm so grateful. And what I'm really grateful for is that so many people mm. have, um, you know, love what we do. They love our art. They appreciate our art. They tune in, knowing that hopefully you're going to see something new and different yeah. that you never thought about before. Um, and they've continued to support us over 27 years. And that, to me, I mean, think about that. How many people do you know, right? I mean, well, although Lynn, I mean, you know, sure. Lenny's going to be on 30 years. You're yeah. 15, yeah. right? Yeah. So, you know, it, it's just amazing, you know, how things uh, come, come to fruition. Obviously, this is a runaway success. The purple kunzai, if you want it, we are final quantities. In terms of the necklace, the necklace at the lowest price, $179.99, that you'll see all year long, an amazing value. Jay, I just want to pick you up on something. Over those years, meeting the miners, going to the, uh, the sources, the mines, how important were the personal relationships that you built, though, to the success of well, the business? Well, you know, and, and there again, you know, even through what we kind of went through, mm -hmm. Uh, we still had new mine finds, right? People, and that is due to the relationships that we have built mm. over four decades. Um, and that's, I, you know, that I love finding new mine finds. I, I love, but you know what I really love? I, I love meeting new people, yeah. uh, seeing new ideas, get, you know, buying new materials, and being able to actually, to tell you the truth, share those, those, uh, those uh, materials and those kind of, you know, the stories about how it's obtained, I, I like to share that with everybody, and it's, it's just really kind of fun. Well, we are always thrilled to share these stories with you folks, and I, I tell you, this story has obviously captured the imaginations. The bracelet, earrings, and ring, which are part of the suite, very limited across the board, so just a few now left. That cuff in particular, Jay, the shape, that you've got here, the design on the sterling silver, I, that, I gravitate towards that. Okay, you know, but if you look at this, okay, and, and, and I, you know, like, um, $79. okay, think about, okay, <laughs> well, which is stupid. Okay, so if you if you think about this, look, look at what you got here. This is all that silver, and that sterling silver sheet material, that's, you know, that is custom made for us in a foundry. So even our sterling silver, the raw material is custom made so that we can put it in our designs. Mm -hmm. We use silversmith. The, the, the lapidary work in this, okay, the natural kunzite, which in this case, it's been fasted. You can see this is, look at the beautiful fasting on that. That shape right there, that's all of those are, you can tell, they're all individually hand cut. There is no machine yes. that will cut that. The only way to do it is do it by hand. And so that's what we do. All the silver work is also done by hand on this design. Uh, and forgive me, I misspoke. The bracelet, the pricing on the screen is going to be for that fabulous stretch bracelet. We will give you the details on the cuff in a few moments. That's a heck of a yeah, deal. Yeah, but Jay, it's only silver. 99 okay, for Okay, well, the that's cuff. even crazy, too. I was thinking something that, uh, you know, I would just buy those and melt them. <laughs> <laughs> that says it all. Okay, so that's pretty good. That but even 99 is ridiculous for that amount of silver. And if you look at this and look at the tinsel string, look at the thickness. This isn't some little thin tchotchke cup. No, 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 cup, no, no, no. Okay, no, no. This, and this has, because it's made from sterling silver sheet material, it has the tinsel strength. The tinsel strength is the hardness that it will retain its shape, right? So you, you don't take this, you're not going to get this and be able to wad it up no, like a piece no, of tin no. foil, right? It has substance to it. 
Okay, so to be clear, the stretch bracelet is $80, right? Or $79.50. The cuff is $99, amazing value for money. And the ring is $89.75. I have a few left of those earrings, but not, not many, which is why I'm not really featuring them. But the earrings, if you want to grab them, the $79 and change as well. It's the softness, it's the mellowness of this beautiful color. It's our gemstone in focus, which is a beautiful kunzite in all of its glory. It's nice to add something new to the collection. Jay, that's part of the story that you've built over the years. Well, yeah, well, well you know, and then what we do, you know, they call it mind finds for a reason. I mean, we literally travel the world and that's what we do. We search out a new and different materials and, but we, we major, you know, we, we majorly were known for our turquoise and we're known for our opals. So that's everything. And this is a spinoff off of that. Actually going to Africa to go check out an opal mine is when I got introduced to this material. So, so many things have happened on the way that were unexpected. Oh no, idea. everything is, it's all spider web. Oh, wow. Yeah. Just crazy. But what a wonderful thing. Okay. Yes. I was wondering where this was at because I have to tell you, this is a great design. Jay, there's 53. We're going to spend 90 seconds here. You will not see this again. This will sell out right now. If you fall in love with Coons, like Jay, give us 90 seconds, Jay, because at this price, obviously, this is a no-brainer. Okay, I have to tell you this. Okay, of all the Kunzite de designs that I've done, okay, this is the one that I'm most proud of. Oh, all right? wow, okay. I'm most proud of this. Look at the size of these crystals. Um, I just saw the price. <laughs> you can't. This is the last of the last. This actually did so well. They wanted to reorder it and we couldn't do it. And I didn't want to actually, really didn't want to bring back the design because, you know, you know, the thing is, is we always want to bring back new and different. This, we had to use so much material up. We used over four pounds of the natural oh materials. Gosh. And this, you have to think about this too. This, these are all cut from the natural crystals. Yep. So you have to, you really have to have the really big, big, big material to be able to do this. And I don't have a lot of the big material. Look at this on uh, Victoria though. I mean, is this massive? Um, it is just unbelievable. And the sparkle, the gleam, the, the sheen on this material is just through the roof. We are less than 30 now left. If you would like it, last chance, last call, massive value. The faceting that you're seeing is obviously just really bringing this to life uh, like no other. And as Jay said, he's very proud of it. And he should be, I mean, you should be very proud of it. Of all the Kunzite designs I've done, this is the one that I would give my mother. <laughs> That's it, that Honestly, oh, by the way, mom says hello. I love Jay's mom. Hi, mom. <laughs> Sold out now, sold out of great value. Uh, you know if it's gonna be for Jay's mom, it's gotta be the best. Right. <laughs> Thank you for your orders there. Jay, do you mind if we spend a couple of minutes? Is it the, 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 yeah, the cuff? Okay, guys, a lot of you are obviously asking for I don't for care, this. I'm, I'm, I'm heading, I'm, here out, I'm, out, I'm out of here, you know, like, I'm just, I'm just here to hear you talk, you know. Yeah, that's the <laughs> Sell this, I want you to sell this. <laughs> <laughs> they, they told me I could learn from you. You're oh, a trained Jay, professional. You were misguided on that one. <laughs> <laughs> we are 134 left, 132 left. Look, Jay, I've only spoken for two seconds, it's selling out. <laughs> This is an amazing buy, less than $100. Jay, look, I, I could sell it on price all night long, as could you, but the truth is to get that cuff for less than 100 bucks with all the design, all the detail, and the, the grandeur of the stone that's in there, it's worth every penny. Well, you know, especially if, okay, if you were able to get that necklace, the one I'm very, very proud of, and I really, truly am proud of that design. It's one of my favorite. Um, this was actually was designed to actually complement that, um, that particular necklace. I love this is a great standalone cuff. If you want, look at the, okay. You have a massive amount of sterling silver here. Massive. This is all sterling silver sheet. That is all hammered sheet. So all those little dings in there, those little hammers that's done on purpose, and that's all done by hand, okay? So they actually <laughs> hammer that out. And then um, you've got this freeform shape uh, that we faceted. Uh, every one of these individual here again, they're yes. individually hand cut. All that, all the bezel, the bezel is the silver work that goes around anything. Mm -hmm. That is all uh, custom done. Do you know when the, uh, okay, the lapidaris in this case, they cut that cabochon. The cabochon mm -hmm. is the kunzite, mm -hmm. right? They give that to the silversmith. Mm -hmm. The silversmith then builds the bezel and the bezel cup 
around that stone. Uh, wow. They actually number them. They'll number the they number the Kunzai cab on the back yeah. in magic marker. Yeah. And then when they build the uh, bezel cup, they actually number that so that they know that that cab goes in that bezel. Wow. Because then what they have to do, of course, they have to pre-polish it and they do a lot of things and they solder that. Of course, they're gonna solder that on the cuff. Sure. Okay, they can't have the stone in there because right. you would crack the stone with the heat. So then they'll do that, but it has that number etched in there so that they know that cabochon goes in that bezel cup because they're all made that they're custom made each each one is a little bit different they're all hand cut they're all a little different so that that is you know that really is art that is custom custom and that's what that's what you're getting when you get that custom custom it is custom i mean you think about that i mean where they custom make a bezel mm -hmm. just for the custom custom made cabochon they're not made they're you know they draw them out they get them close mm. but i'm just telling you how i could demonstrate this if i have a micrometer you yeah. know like a measure sure. i could sit here and, and you would see what i was talking about what's better than custom 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 is better than custom <laughs> that's what you've got now, with see, this. this is why you can't tell the british anything okay <laughs> you can't tell these people anything <laughs> thank you for the moment AJ. that's what i'm doing thank you for your orders here obviously this will sell out as well what a great buy i think we were all in awe of the fact that it's under a hundred dollars um if jay's here you know we must be talking gemstones it is gem month on hsn and if you go to hsn.com you can search all the fabulous gemstones, styles and looks, the thing that you want, that you are searching for. I bet we've got it, man. I bet we've got a great value on it. Simply go to hsn.com and grab everything. Maybe it's turquoise. We've got Campitos turquoise that I always enjoy talking about. Look at that designer look right there. We enjoy that one. That's 097317 very limited on the earrings and the pendant if you'd like to order well jay before you jet off to uh, back home and then back to england um, we want to end the hour the way we started with a this day only if you're just joining us you miss the hoopla surrounding this this is as your peaks it is 79.99 it took us all by storm uh, the beauty, the character, the personality of this, uh, the, I mean, the size, look how grand this is. Five flex pay, buy more and save as well with shipping and handling. Jay, our regular price is $148.50, which is by anybody's standards amazing. We're at $79.99. That price is about to go up because our day is nearly over. But it has to start with the beauty of this particular style and personality of turquoise. And you know, this turquoise here again, this comes from the Azure Peaks deposit. Um, this material, you know, the reason I know this is, okay, with this, uh, we got started um, on this material about 10 years ago. And we actually learned about this material through a geologist friend. Um, and you know, the, what the geologists do is they're going out and they're, they, they're, they're not looking for turquoise. Right. Okay, they're looking for gold, silver, platinum, palladium, lead, nickel, I mean, you know, copper. Um, in this case, when, here's the, here's the key, they found this turquoise. When they find turquoise, it, they have to, you cannot not have copper. And it has to be um, fairly rich for the, for the turquoise to form. Now you could have the largest copper deposit in the entire world mm. and not have a single piece of turquoise. Is that crazy? You cannot have turquoise and not have uh, copper present in fairly dense um, quantities because it's a major component in uh, developing of, of how turquoise is formed. Wow. It's one of the key ingredients. So. Um, this material was the first, and the reason I say this, this is some of the first material that we got out of the Azure Peaks because it is um, the, the more of the green with the uh, brown matrix. Even the brown here on this is all turquoise. So can you test that, that's gonna test as, as turquoise. Um, it is, uh, this was the first material that, that they really discovered. Mm -hmm. And now it's an active open pit copper mine and they're pulling blue material out of it. And you're, we're starting to see blue material. So this is something that I'm hoping to continue. Now, with that being said, I'm telling you guys, look, th there is no way 
there is no way that you could even buy the material, mm -hmm. especially this is 10 years ago, right, is when we bought this, which is another thing, just so everybody knows. When we buy this material, any of these designs that you're seeing, a lot of this material, even our lapis is a perfect example. Um, that material was bought 25 years ago. I'm not bumping up the rough cost. Right. When, you know, that's how we're able to give you a lot of the, the values. We, a lot of these materials, if you had to buy them, would be three, four, five hundred percent higher. This material's gone up, um, not that much, but it, it, it's gone up at least, at least 50 to 60 percent uh, now. And, and we're really at source on it. So um, this is like a stupid, stupid deal. Jay, it is always a fun day when you're here, sir. It's always fun working with you. In fact, I just love working with you. I have, oh, I love I have so much fun. So hopefully uh, you don't see me for a month. What? <laughs> a whole month? <laughs> I know. Yeah, and everybody out there is going, oh, thank goodness. <laughs> you know, everybody's going, oh, my God. It's, I just made everybody's day. See, and that's what I wanted to do, end off on a good note you give and make everybody's day. So you're not going to see me for a month. I hope you have a wonderful time in England. <laughs> Same troubles, my friend. And I look forward to next month, OK? OK, me. See you soon. The amazing sure. Jay King here, exclusive. He's exclusively on the Home Shopping Network, and we love him. Uh, thank you for your orders on our This Day Only. Buying more and saving more, that's what we love to do. Buy one jewelry item at standard shipping rates and get 50% off shipping for all of the jewelry all day long, which we love. On the way next, live from New York City, it's Carol Brody 